my best buddy Jeremiah I'm waiting for you. Come with me, I don't want to ask why. I'm glad Jeremiah was the one to do this because he is my favorite villager I own. Or I don't own them. Slavery's bad. He's the best villager I have in my town. See, I wanna I wanna know what they'll give me as gifts. I didn't know if there's anything special birthday gifts or birthday items you'll get for being in on your birthday, but... I get a pin. Oh, I get a pin. A pinata. Yes, I think it came out really good. Even more good. Give me that. Oh, how do I? I was not reading or paying attention at all when he was talking. Stand on the pinata. Okay, so I had to talk to him to activate it first. Give me the candy. I'm hungry. <gasps> okay. I don't know, I don't think cupcakes are the best idea to put in a pinata, because now they're just going to be disgusting and dirty. But uh, I'll eat one, because my best buddy uh, Jeremiah made me some cupcakes. Well, now I know what villagers to get rid of because the ones that didn't show up to my birthday, I'm just gonna get try and make them stop talking to them, make them leave, because uh, they obviously don't know how much power I hold if they don't even show up to my birthday. So, oh, yeah, I got, oh, I actually get cupcakes. I actually get to keep them. And I get the birthday cake. That's okay. That's pretty cool. I want the, I want the rest of this stuff though. Let's go see what that cake looks like. I'm guessing it's the one that they already had on the table, but. to me and always give some celebration to good cake and friends. Let's see if the mom in this game ever gave me anything. So I got a cake from mom, which is a kitty. And then I get a cake from my friends, which is great. I'm gonna go inside and put these in there. I, got, I actually have a new kitchen that I just built, so this will be perfect in the kitchen, because I have a stand mixer beside it. So now I'm a little baker boy. Okay, let's get the cake. I'm thinking birthday cake. Sorry, mom, but like, my friends made a better cake, so. Yeah. 
I'll keep it. Yeah, put it in storage. And then I'm gonna move this and put the cupcake right there. Sweet. I, I don't know. It really looks like uh, it brings the the baking kitchen up to, to. I think it really brings the kitchen together with like actual foods because I haven't been able to find a lot of foods yet. So. I think that's all they do for my birthday. I'm gonna go talk to Tom Nook and see if he does anything special, but. I don't think he would because he's kind of a cheapskate, so giving gifts doesn't seem like something he's really fond of. And I guess while I'm walking around, you'll get to see the updates I did to my island. I didn't do too many updates. I did a little bit of things. I don't want to talk to you, Antonio. I want you to leave my town real bad. I'll talk to Eric. I just added some bushes and stuff like that since those got added to the game, but most of the stuff hasn't been changed too much. Let's see if anything happens when I go in here for my birthday. Okay, so he doesn't do anything about my birthday, so I'm guessing the birthday party was it. But it was super cute, and I'm glad Jeremiah was the host of it, because he is my favorite villager. So I'm glad I didn't pick someone I hate like Antonio, or Alton. What is his name? What is his name? I always call him Antonio, but I'm not sure if that's right. Yeah, it's to Antonio. I don't, I, I, I've been trying to get him out of my village. He was my first villager. And I've been trying to get him out of this town ever since I saw him. He's just, uh, he's annoying. Does these guys do anything for my birthday? Nope. Well, I guess that's everything that happens on your birthday in Animal Crossing. I was thinking there'd be a little bit more, but I'm really glad that um, I didn't forget about it. Because if I would have forgot about it, I wouldn't have got the birthday cakes and stuff like that. And I wouldn't have been able to hang out with my best friend, Jeremiah. 